Hey, what is up guys? My name is Josiah and welcome back to another edition of my Modern House tutorial series. Now, as requested by many of you, the house I'll be building today has a much more spacious interior compared to my regular houses, providing plenty of space for all the essential rooms. However, it still keeps a small and simple design that should be fairly easy to build. So without any further ado, let's get right into building it. First up, we will lay out the foundation of the building. So let's begin by laying out a 9x10 area of oak planks that is 7 blocks tall. Then off the left side of this, go over 4 blocks and build a wall that spans the length of the foundation with a height of 4 blocks. Next we will build clay columns between these two oak walls. So from both walls, go out a block and build a 9 tall column of grey hardened clay. Then go around to the back and build two more of these columns at the same spots. Now at the 5th block up, add a layer of this clay across the 4 columns. Then also connect the clay columns across the top layer, although leave a 6x2 gap at the middle so we can place black stained glass in for a skylight. Now come over to the left side and fill in the clay wall from this fifth layer up. Lastly we can fill in the gaps of the front and back of these columns with black stained glass paints and also replace the grass at the bottom layer with stone slabs. Next we will add a quartz frame around the building. So starting at the right side of the clay wall, go up 3 blocks and wrap a layer of quartz stairs around to the back. Then above the quartz stairs, wrap a layer of upside down quartz stairs around the same area. Now go over to the left side of the clay walls and add two rows of quartz blocks out from the top of the oak planks.
and also add another layer of quartz under the second row of quartz blocks. Then with these blocks in place, we can add the same two layers of quartz stairs and upside down stairs around the left side of these clay walls. Next we will add the roof over top the oak walls on the right side. So first add a layer of quartz blocks over this section. Then we'll add a row of quartz slabs on top of the quartz blocks that overhang out a block. And lastly, we'll add a row of quartz slabs off the bottom of the quartz blocks. Next, we'll add two columns of quartz blocks under the frames on every side. So go over two blocks from the walls on each side and add in a quartz column. Now we will add in all the doors and windows to the house. So first let's move back a 3x3 section of the wall between the quartz columns at the front and add in a door at the middle of it. Then also add 3 upside down oak stairs above the door. Next we'll add windows and window sills between all the other quartz columns. So first add upside down oak stairs along the bottom layer with flowers at the ends. Then add black stained glass panes in the wall above the upside down stairs. Now come back to the front and above the quartz frame add two 3 wide windows of black stained glass panes here and at the back as well. Next we will edit the balcony on the left side, so first add black stained glass panes around the edge for a railing. Then go over two blocks from the back corner of the clay wall and clear out a 2x2 two two area so we can add in two doors. Also go over 3 blocks from the doors and add in a 2 wide window of black stained glass panes. 
Then at the sides of the window, add two oak stairs for chairs and add two fences between them with carpets on top for a table. Lastly, let's head back to the front entrance and replace five rows of grass in front of the door with stone slabs for the walkway. Then add leaves at the sides of the walkway and in front of the oak walls around the building. Next, you will head inside to edit the interior. So first, come to the back corner of the oak wall at the left side and remove a 2x2 two two section of the wall. Then we can replace the grass inside with quartz blocks for the flooring or with any block of your choice. Now starting at the center of the window at the back wall, place up a two wide oak staircase and at the top of it placing quartz blocks for the second floor. Now on the second floor, remove four layers of the oak wall at the left side and add four quartz stairs along the bottom. Then extend a new oak wall from the end of this oak wall at the left side and add two doors at the end. And lastly, for the second floor, add black stained glass panes around the staircase for a railing. Now let's go back downstairs and at the edge of the staircase build up two oak walls and add a row of oak planks under the stairs. Then at the left side of the door, extend an oak wall back to the staircase and add a door at the end. Now with that last wall in place, we won't have to make any more structural changes to the interior, so as always, I'll leave any furniture and decoration of the house up to you guys, however, I'll quickly show you how mine looks as an example.
But that is going to be all for this Modern House tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed and thank you so much for watching. As always, I'd love to hear all your feedback and don't forget to drop a like if you enjoyed as that would be much appreciated. And with that said, I hope to see you guys in the next video. Later guys, bye bye.